Welcome to the official YouTube channel of Fusion PBX. My name is Len, and today we're going to cover how to contribute to the Fusion PBX documentation. So here we have our docs at docs.fusionpbx.com. And what we'll do is say, we will go to home, and then click on home. Say we want to contribute. We want to add something to this section. We want to edit this section at the top right here. We will click on edit on GitHub. And this is in mind that you have already signed up for GitHub and have an account and also sign the contributor license agreement that is found here if you need it. Okay, so we will go back to here. And basically um, how this works is um, we use um, read the docs and read the docs uh, can tie into GitHub. So document uh, documentation is treated like code is. So what you do is you click on this edit icon and you'll notice a message up here saying that you're editing a file in a project you don't have right access to. So this is going to create a fork so we're just going to make a small edit Put a period there and a period there. We click on preview changes. Always good to do that to see what was changed. You'll notice indicating here and here. If you can notice slightly, it's in green right there, showing the edits that were made and a preview of what it's going to look like. And at the bottom, we're going to say add a period or format update. And then click on propose, propose file change, if I can talk today. <laughs> Okay, so at the bottom you'll notice in red is what it was, and in green is what it is now. Okay, so one thing you want to notice up here is you have the base fork of Fusion PBX slash Fusion PBX dash docs, which is that's the repo, and the base of master, that's the branch. And you'll notice on our side, our side here, there is the head fork, and the git pull demo is my name on GitHub for this demo, and Fusion PBX docs is the repo, and this is the branch. It since we did the um, edit on the um, repo that we don't have right access to it creates a fork, makes a copy of it, puts it in our repo, and puts it in its own separate branch, and usually calls it patch dash whatever. So all you need to do now is click on uh, this, create pull request, add any edits if needed, and then create. Uh, click on the create pull request. Okay, and that's our pull request. So you'll notice that we're in the Fusion PBX repo now. You notice that here also. So if we go just to github.com slash Fusion PBX and then the Fusion PBX docs. You'll notice up here there's a one pull request 
and that's what we just did right there so people that have access um, on the fusion pbx team will notice this and um, either put a comment either accept the pull request or um, maybe add some more comments saying more more information might be needed or maybe uh, something needs to be rephrased or maybe the information isn't correct or um, either way you know we will work with you and get it accepted okay and that is a basic demonstration on how to do a pull request have a great day be sure to visit www.fusionpbx.com